The physical fitness testing consists of push-ups, sit-ups, 1.5 mile run. Push-ups and sit-ups are timed for a minute. Applicants must complete as many as possible in a minute. There's a standard to complete the 1.5 mile run in. The test requires pushing one's own weight off the floor. This measures the amount of force the upper body can generate and is an important area of performing police tasks requiring upper body strength. The score is calculated by the number of push-ups performed in one minute. The body is supported by the hands and feet touching the ground, with legs straight and off the ground. The chest must come down and touch a fist placed under the individual's chest, then the arms must go to full extension to complete the push-up. Given the current COVID crisis, this is amended to the upper arms have to break the 90 degree angle at the elbow. Some common errors for push-ups include any part of your body touching the ground, your arms not breaking the 90 degree angle at the elbows, not fully extending the arms when pushing back up, your body not being straight, and resting in the down position. If you rest, you have to be in the up position. The one minute sit up test. This is a measure of the muscular endurance of the abdominal muscles. It is an important area of performing police tasks that may involve the use of force and is an important area for maintaining good posture and minimizing lower back problems. The score is in number of bent leg sit ups performed in one minute. Hands must remain on or about the head. In the up position, elbows should touch the knees or upper portion of the thigh. In the down position, the back must come down so that the shoulder blades touch the floor. Legs may be held for assistance. Airs in the sit-up test include elbows not touching the legs when coming up, not going all the way down, or the shoulders not touching the ground, lifting the hips off the ground, hands off of the head, resting in the down position. The 1.5 mile run. This is a timed run to measure the heart and vascular system's capability to transport oxygen. It is an important area of performing police tasks involving stamina and endurance and to minimize the risk of cardiovascular problems. The scores in minutes and seconds. The most common reason for failing the 1.5 mile run is not making time. We hope this answers some of the questions that you have about the physical testing portion of the application process. Now is the time to start preparing for it though. Get out there, practice that run, those push-ups and sit-ups, and definitely start stretching. You don't want to get to testing day to find out that you're going to fall short. If you have any other questions about this or any other parts of the application process, please do not hesitate to get a hold of us and we'll get back to you and try to answer those questions as best as possible. Good luck and we look forward to seeing you on testing day.